Okay, it's time to customize the home page. Okay, let's go ahead and follow the steps here all the way from top to bottom and we'll get the points right after. So create a new home page using Lightning App Builder. So go ahead to your Trailhead Playground to set up and then Lightning App Builder, search it. Go there. And let's make a new one. So we want to follow the steps exactly because we know the challenge is checking the playground to match the steps. It has to be done exactly as it's laid out. So well, let's name this support home page. I'm gonna copy this guy and hit next. So it will be a home page because you are customizing the home page. Next. Support home page. Next. So which one do we want to use? Standard home page template and finish. So the standard home page and finish. So we have these sections available for us to drag and drop from the, from the available components on the left. You can search what components you want to narrow it down. So you can drag it to the right side. Let's follow along. Display the five most recent cases. So drag the recent items component and then name it recent cases. So I'm going to search recent items. You can search here. And then drag it. Where would we like to drag it? Most recent items. Um, yeah, let's drag it here. And the label here recent cases the object would be case right case there we don't want to count actually okay and what else do we have here so click select and drag any case to spot in the account and remove account which we did click ok the number of records to display five so the number of records to display five and we are going to save it well not yet we're not done yet so we won't activate that yet that's only the first section now show chatter post where the support rep is at mentioned so we want to drag the chatter feed directed to me all right so chatter feed directed to me chatter feed let's put it on the far right here okay so feed type to me is there anything else that we need to apply that would be all so I'm going to save this again all right next show today's tasks and upcoming events so drag the today's task and then today's events today's tasks let's put it on here and today's events put it on there display a link to a salesforce trust site drag the rich text right into the today's task box box so rich text today's task box drag it there okay and then we want to put in the text entry field be sure to check task for a salesforce trust site highlight the text and then link it to trust.salesforce.com here on here there and then highlight the text and link it to trust.salesforce.com
that I think it should be secure right I'm going to save that and save again so now we want to activate the new home page click save in the upper right corner which we did activate and then we want to assign to an app and profile so let's do that I'm gonna save first activate so here uh, do we want to assign to org default not yet for this particular challenge or trail so assign to apps and profile which we want so we want to be the service uh, profile service console right let's see I'm select service and click next select custom support profile and system administrator so we've we've selected service there's no service just service console okay next support and system administrator we have system administrator here do we have support user custom support profile right that's what is being asked yeah support profile okay and then uh, next and save save activation successful so that's it um, click the app launcher and select service so to activate that I'm gonna hit back and if I hit service here well not service we we actually choose surf, uh, service console right we actually choose service console home page which is wrong so let's go back to our setup here I think we did something wrong so lightning I think I missed it app builder and then support home page yeah let's edit this guy for activation um app and profile we don't want to actually have a service console we have we want to assign it to service lightning app service which we don't see here okay since we don't see it here i'm just going to assign this to sales for now just to show you how it's going to look like and then to um, system administrator and custom support profile now if I go back again and I even go here and I'm just gonna go to sales There. recent cases and we have this we have this but now we can't assign this to the service app right we're supposed to assign this to the service app okay it's because the service app over here is in classic here classic right that's why it's not showing up so I want it to be available in lightning experience it's already checked there show in lightning experience so it should be both in classic and lightning 
Okay, I think you get the point. Now, let's just verify to earn the 100 points. Boom! I'll see you on the next video. Hit that subscribe button and explore new trailhead grounds and learn to implement the most useful and popular apps on the Salesforce App Exchange. And do yourself a favor, like this video and you'll be surprised on how much more you understand when watching this same video after liking it. Don't take my word watch this one more time after you like the video and see it for yourself bada bing bada boom